Yeah, I mean, Munster are being forced to defend superbly there. They really are. Tomas O'Leary smashed, smashed Neil Decott here. He wants to get the ball away. He's quick and he's ready. He then, a couple of seconds later, floors Horton, who's trying to counter-attack. O'Connell from the quick one. O'Leary, O'Gara, what a time to strike this would be. And everybody in the ground knows it. O'Leary again from Lima's run forward. Out to Dowling. Leonelli was lining him up. Maffey. Hands away, Black! Black call! Advantage over! O'Gara wants to have to play it now. Stay on your feet! Good. And had a chance for the referee to stop it, but that is not in their thought process because the wingers, Dowling and Howlett, are combining here. Howlett almost up to that 22. Quinlan! Alan Quinlan! Just before half time. This lot have reserves that. Others simply don't have. That's the moment when Old Munster and New Munster merge today. Old Munster is epitomised by this man. He is the essence, Alan Quinlan of Munster. He's all heart and intelligence and back row doggedness. But Topoki and Doug Howlett created something out of nothing. They're the new men. The little step in from Topoki, Howlett. That is the fresh blood for which Declan Kidney has been looking. That's the injection, and now here's old Munster. Quinlan, pick and go. Saracens are spreading wide. A brilliant decision from this excellent, intelligent blindside. Had a chance to go with the referee, Munster didn't want to take it. They centred more. That's great. Great combination between Dowling and Howlett, and then Alan Quinlan is there to finish it off. And who missed out on the final. The winning final, that is.